In this video, I shall show you how to force borderless full screen in any game you wish to play. Now you should use borderless full screen if you want to play the game in full screen mode, but you don't want any of the downsides to it, such as whenever you click the windows button or you pull up another application and then your game suddenly closes down and disconnects you from the server because it's not focused anymore. Um, borderless full screen fixes this issue and so this video will show you how you can force borderless full screen in any game you want without any downsides. To accomplish this we will be using a program called borderless gaming. When playing games with full screen borderless I would recommend turning off your taskbar whenever it's not in use. The reason for this is that the application may still be in full screen and the taskbar will cover the bottom part of your application. To mitigate this problem, I turn off the taskbar and for you to do this as well, simply open up settings, then find personalization, scroll down, find taskbar, scroll down again and find taskbar behaviors. Now, make sure automatically hide the taskbar is enabled. Now whenever the taskbar isn't in use, it will simply hide away, which is perfect for when you're trying to play your full screen borderless games. And then whenever you need the taskbar again, simply drag your mouse downwards, or click the Windows key and the taskbar should also appear. To download borderless gaming, use the link in the video's description, and it should open something that looks like this. Next, look underneath Assets and you should find Borderless Gaming Admin Setup. This is what we'll use to install Borderless Gaming. To download, simply click on Admin Setup, select where you want to download the file to, and then click Save. Now it should be downloaded. To install Borderless Gaming, double click on the application you've downloaded and accept the administrator prompt and then proceed to agree with the terms and conditions. And after that, click Next. Then choose whether you want a desktop shortcut, click Next again, and now the installation should be complete. To open up Borderless Gaming, now that you have it installed, simply open up Windows Search and type Borderless. It should come up. If not, type Borderless Gaming. Now simply open, and it will ask you to run it as an administrator. Accept this so that it can change the sizes of the applications. Now that Borderless Gaming has opened, you'll notice that I have a few favorites. That's because I've already used this before. For this demonstration, I will be using Minecraft Bedrock. First, you must open the application and ensure the application is running in windowed mode. To double check this, ensure full screen is off. Now that full screen is off and you're in windowed mode, you can use borderless gaming to toggle Minecraft's size. To do this, simply find the application you want to change the size and then click this little arrow that points to the right. The game should now be in almost full screen, but you may notice that there's a little bar at the top. To remove this, what we must do is right click on Minecraft and then select no size change and then click on set windows size. Answer no to this question, as we must input the numbers ourselves. This first number should be zero. The second one should be minus 40, because this will get rid of the bar at the top. The next two are slightly more difficult, as it will depend on what monitor you are using and what the resolution is. 
I am using a 2560 by 1440p resolution monitor. So the width is 2560. The height again is 1440, but because we took off 40 pixels, we have to add on 40 pixels on this stage. So it will be 1480 instead. Sometimes Minecraft will update automatically, or whatever application you've changed, or sometimes you have to enable full screen and then turn off full screen. So if I enable full screen and then turn it off, there we go. Minecraft is now updated and it's in full screen without any of the downsides. <laughs>